And the Hope women won the NCAA Division III championship on Saturday. Head coach Brian Morehouse got to cut down the nets for the second time in his career. The team flew home today when they pulled up to the DeVos Fieldhouse. They had a police escort, were greeted by hundreds of fans. Hey, why not celebrate? Marley Weirdo was with the Flying Dutch in Pittsburgh. She caught up with him again today and had this conversation with Brian Morehouse and a couple of players. Coach, I imagine it's been a, a crazy 24 hours for your team. Can you just take me through uh, what these last uh, couple hours have been like for you guys? Yeah, it was. It's been wild. You know, it's uh, 24 hours ago we win the national championship and we we're on a bus heading back today. And uh, you know, it was just kind of bedlam after the game. I just all a blur after we win it. Uh, the trophy ceremony and uh, just watching those women walk up that ladder and cut down their piece of the net. Um, just unreal. How proud are you as a coach to see your women uh, accomplish this and, and just all that they've been able to do this season? You know, I think I, I'm proud of them for what they did on the court, but I'm also proud that it kind of provides a platform for us to be able to showcase what they are off the court as well. They're an incredible group of students, 3.7 team grade point average, and just incredible women going into professions and graduate schools. So. Um, it, it's, it's pride in what they've accomplished off the court, but obviously the on the court stuff is uh, pretty special. This is the second national title for you. Uh, what makes this one so special? I think the process behind it, you know, uh, it's, it's been maddening, you know, the last three years uh, to go through a cancellation and then another cancellation. And then finally this year with all the pressure firmly on our players and our coaching staff to really kind of prove it. You know, we were number one the last two years before that got canceled and then all the pressure firmly on us and they stepped up to the plate and knocked it out of the park all year long and really um, validated it this weekend with two great wins in Pittsburgh. And to celebrate this with three generations of family, yeah. your father, yep. your daughter, Meg, what is that like for you to have this be such a, a family moment for you guys? Yeah, it's uh, I mean, pretty amazing when you get to go to work with your dad and your daughter and uh, show up at a gym and coach the game that you love with uh, people that they love, you know, their teammates. And um, it's, it's suit certainly special, but uh, to have those three generations together is, uh, it makes it even better. All right, Coach, thank you so much. I want to turn the focus and talk to some of your players here. We're here with uh, Kate Majerus and uh, Claire Bagley. Guys, take me through just this celebration. You had tons of fans waiting for you guys when you got off the bus. What was that like? Yeah, the Hope community has been super great over the past however many weeks that we've been playing here. Um, whether they were in Pittsburgh or in Michigan, they were always supporting us um, and have definitely shown out. So that's been super great. Yeah, it's definitely surreal, like having fans in Pittsburgh, and then we come back and we see a lot of the same fans here. They just drove six and a half hours home, and they're waiting for us on our return. So um, we feel really honored to have that kind of support system. And I think you guys were so confident this season. You know, you didn't shy away from your goals, which was ultimately to make a deep run in the NCAA tournament, to go to the Final Four, to win a national championship. What do you think gave you so much confidence this season? Yeah, I think we're very intentional from the start of the season to lay out our goals for the entire season. So we have this thing, we make it like a pyramid. And so at the base are just like the basic things of what we need to do daily, whether it's like um, keeping our spaces clean, thanking um, individuals that we see. So like the basics, and then we kind of go up through the pyramid and then at the top is the national championship. So um, being able to have that visual throughout the season and um, just know exactly what points we're trying to hit was super beneficial for us. Yeah. And within just March, we've really emphasized believing in ourselves and believing in our teammates. And I think we had a genuine belief in this team and in our teammates and that showed up on the court. We never thought we were going to lose throughout the game because we just trusted each other and had each other's backs. What's next? Is it back to practice or are you guys going <laughs> to celebrate a little bit longer? What, what comes next for you guys? Uh, at least for me, I'm going to rest my body for a couple days and then we'll um, reconsider everything for sure. Yeah, same here. <laughs> so, <laughs> I need a little rest. Yeah. Awesome. What do you feel like uh, this national championship signifies for the standard of the program and what you guys were able to accomplish, not just this season, but maybe setting the standard for teams to come after you guys? I think just in the future, it's just like set a goal, stick to it and focus on the little things as well. Like I think we're a tough team and we're in the gym and you can't really bypass that even if you have a bigger goal of a national championship. So like have that big goal, but also keep in mind that you got to do the little things. You got to do the tough stuff along the way.
Now, I heard something maybe about getting tattoos to celebrate. <laughs> is yeah. that uh, <laughs> is that still in the cards for you guys? Um, it's in the plan, and Coach Brian Morehouse will be joining in on that. <laughs> so, so we're yeah. very much looking forward to that. Exactly. We're not sure who's going to plan that out, but it's coming in the near future okay. for sure. What is the, the design? Any, like, brainstorming <laughs> ideas yet for what it's maybe going to look like? Oh, well, we know. <laughs> I can't really do it. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be this. That's yeah. kind of been a been a symbol for us all season yep. so means a lot to us and I think it is a big um, indicator of how we got here and who we are as friends and teammates throughout the season yep. so <laughs> all right guys thank you so much Claire Kate Brian congratulations once again